Success happens when you don't want to, but choose to do it anyway. Everybody, Justin here with Next Steps Coaching, and today I want to give you the three obstacles that you are going to have to overcome on your pursuit of success. Uh, the reality is that each and every day you're going to wake up, and some days you're just going to be more naturally motivated. Some days you'll, you'll have the drive, maybe you have an exciting sales call, an appointment you're looking forward to, you've had a bit of good news, maybe you just got a good night's sleep after being so tired. And then there will be those other days where you don't want to, and you're going to have to do it anyway. And the differentiator between people who experience success on the pursuit of their goals, whatever they are, and the people that don't, are those that when they aren't feeling that motivation, that drive, choose to do it anyway. So what are the three obstacles that you're going to have to overcome? Well, the first is failure. That bit of good news isn't always going to come. And there will, there will be days where you'll make the sales call and you will think, hey, this went really well. They're absolutely going to buy from me. I'm going to close this. And you start to, to dream and think and imagine of all the things you're going to be able to do and how wonderful it'll be. And then they email or call or text back and like, you know what, now is just not the right time. It's 10 o'clock in the morning and I've failed. And now this mythical money that I've already spent, I don't actually have what do I do with the rest of my work day? You have a couple of options, right? You can you can push through, you can you can take a second, you can feel the the you can feel the guilt, the 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 shame, the frustration, the anger, the hurt, the disappointment, whatever the feeling is, and then you can sit there and wallow in it and waste an entire day. Or you can say, I still have a wonderful opportunity to push through and make this a great day. And People who experience success take that second option. So the first obstacle you're going to have to overcome is failure. The second is fear. Well, what if this grows quickly? What, what if I actually do land that big contract? What if somebody finds out that I'm a, a fraud, right? With this kind of fake it till you make it syndrome. The, that we generate these lists of fears in our heads that can keep us from chasing our goals. And so we... Uh, we will give the appearance maybe of working hard or of striving for success and yet secretly through our, our mindset or through some of our daily habits, sabotaging ourselves so that we don't experience too much success. I know that sounds crazy, but it happens a lot, especially with a lot of the clients I work with. They start to experience some of that early win and that momentum and they sense this life change and they feel this growth opportunity happening and quite honestly, it can be a bit scary and a bit unnerving and then they start to back off just a little bit. And then that fear takes over and they begin to settle. And the third thing that you can, uh, the third obstacle that you may just have to overcome quite, quite honestly is motivation because some days you won't get a good night's sleep. Toss and turn and the pillow doesn't lay right. It's too hot. It's too cold. You're in a hotel bed. The kids kept you up. Something you ate isn't agreeing with your stomach. Whatever it is, you're going to wake up and you're just like, I'm not feeling it today. And I'm home alone and I'm an entrepreneur and I get to set my own schedule and man, nobody would notice if I played video games or watched TV or goofed off. Nobody really cares if I waste four hours a day on Facebook. I can call it research, but we all know that it's not. And some days you won't have the motivation to push through. But succumbing to any of those three, whether you wanna, whether you wanna talk about succumbing to, to, to the fear, to the failure or to the motivation, Giving in to any of those three temptations will ultimately keep you from a life of destiny that you have been created for. It will keep you from a life of fulfillment. It will keep you from experiencing that amazing, successful vision of your future that God has put inside of you. So be on the lookout for those. Don't settle. Don't give in. Don't give up. Thanks for watching, everybody. This is Just with Next Steps Coaching. Be sure that you uh, subscribe. Be sure that you check out uh, another video on my channel. Please give me a like, uh, a comment, and subscribe. Turn on those notifications so that you get notified when we launch new videos here on the channel. I will see you guys next time.